This item here is the security manager from Refined Storage. So how do we use it and what does it do? If I right click into it, you, it brings up this screen. So what you're going to want to make is a security card as shown here. You then take the security card and you bind it to a player. You can right click on the player or from binding it to myself as this is on a single player tutorial, I shift and right click. And now I look at the security card and it says it's bound to me. What I then do is I right click the security manager, put the security card in, and then I'm basically selecting the permissions that this player can do in this network. Can they insert? Can they extract? Maybe I'm going to say that this player can insert into my network, but they're not allowed to extract items. I then take the security card out, and as you can see, it says bound to this person, and they can insert. Now, what you'll see is that this security manager is connected to this network. Meaning, if I then get the security card and put it up to the top here, so it has all these slots for different players, this now means that this player can insert but not extract. So if I go into a grid here, you can see it says no permission to perform that action. Whereas if I put more permissions on here, now I can access it. And that is pretty much how the security manager works in refined storage. So you bind the security cards to different players, and then you put them in to the top slot here, um, once configured, and you can put them into configure or unconfigure, um, and then any security manager that is attached to this network will then be bound by that. If you have no security cards in here, all players will be able to do everything.